how to hide desktop icons or files or folders in your Mac. If you're using MacBook Air, MacBook Pro, iMac or Mac mini, the steps are going to be same. Now, as you all can see, I have only one folder on my desktop because I like to keep the desktop clean. But if you are a person who has multiple files and folders uh, on desktop, but still, if you want to keep uh, your desktop clean, then all you can do is uh, you can just simply hide the files and folders and icons which are present on the desktop. So how can you do that? So there are a few ways, uh, one of which is by using terminal, you can, you know, simply hide all the files and folders which are present on the desktop. But I'm going to guide you through the simple steps you can follow in order to hide it. So first of all, you can go in system settings, you can find that option in dock or else go and select Apple logo and then select system settings. So once you go in system settings, you can go in general and go in software update and make sure you are updated to the latest OS. Now, once you do that, after that, you can simply go and select desktop and dock. And once you select desktop and dock, go down. And over here, you have an option of desktop and stage manager in which the first option is show items. Now it has two more options. One is on desktop and another one is in stage manager. So if you want to show the folders and files which are uh, present on the desktop, you can select this option. But if you want to hide it, you can just, you know, again, select it. Uh, basically, you don't have to check this box. And as soon as you do that, you can see the one folder which was available on the desktop is now hidden. So I cannot access that folder from my desktop. And now the desktop looks clean. So no one can easily access any personal files or folders over here. In order for you to access that particular file or folder, you can still do it in finder. So you can go in finder option over here. And over here in favorites, you can find desktop, you can select desktop, and that particular folder will still be there. Now the next thing is, when you hide uh, the files and folders on the desktop, if you try to create new folder now, so let's create a new folder, I'm going to press command plus shift plus n. Now the new folder is created, but it is still not visible in order to access it again, go in finder, again, go in desktop. And now this time you can see there is a new folder over here. Now if I close it, if I again create a new folder, I'm going to press command plus shift plus n again, new folder is created, but it is not visible on the desktop. Now to access it, go in finder in desktop and you can find the new folder, which you have created. So this is how simple it is to hide you know, icons, uh, files and folders which are present on your desktop. Now, if you want that back on your desktop, simply go in system settings, go in desktop and dock and make sure to select this on desktop option. If you select all the files are back on the desktop. So yeah, that's how you can hide and unhide your files or folders which are present on your desktop. If you find this video informative, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you.